Hello everyone, Ace here, and today let's talk about the fact that Elon Musk is now officially suing the state of California over a law that violates the First Amendment. This news broke thanks to the Global Government Affairs account, which tweeted, quote, Today, at X filed a First Amendment lawsuit against California AB 587. As made clear by both the legislative history and public court submissions from the Attorney General in defending the law, the true intent of AB 587 is to pressure social media platforms to eliminate certain constitutionally protected content viewed by the state as problematic. You can read our filing here. And yes, the filing does indeed take up the argument that the purpose behind this particular law is to pressure social media companies to censor speech that the government does not like. And even, conveniently enough, provides direct quotes from politicians saying that that is indeed the intent of the law. And for the record, those quotes are indeed taking up the position that it's somehow a good thing to violate people's First Amendment rights. So obviously, the fact that this law even exists completely buries the argument that social media platforms are just private companies companies and can therefore do whatever they want, because the people making that particular excuse would now have to completely ignore the fact that the government is actively passing laws with the specific purpose of pressuring social media platforms to do whatever the government wants as far as free speech is concerned, or more accurately, the lack of free speech at this point. Needless to say, this is another case of me having to completely support Elon Musk in this particular circumstance, because the right to free speech should be protected, and if if he's going to sue the California state government in order to accomplish that, then honestly, I have to support that. Now, this isn't to say that I believe that Elon Musk winning that lawsuit will just make all the censorship problems on social media right now go away, because let's face it, that's obviously not what is going to happen here. After all, the decision to censor people was something that social media companies have been volunteering to do, albeit while doing the bidding of government agencies such as the FBI, as proven by the Twitter files. But it is also worth noting that those very same Twitter files prove that these social media platforms were quite eager in in engaging in such un-American activities. To the extreme that they even surprised the government agencies that they were actively working with. So no, Elon Musk winning that lawsuit won't magically make the censorship problem go away. It may, however, lay the groundwork for getting rid of it in the long run, however, as it may ultimately demonstrate the need to pass laws that further guarantee and protect the right of free speech and prevent social media companies from engaging in such censorship, especially when it's done at at the behest of the government itself. Even now, the very existence of this law completely destroys the argument that social media platforms are just private companies, bro. And they can do whatever they want, bro. Because even if these companies were willing to do that on their own, the fact that they are being pressured by laws by the government itself to engage in such un-American activities completely derails the argument that it's just private companies at that point. Now, for those curious, I will of course be leaving links in the description below to the sources that I have used so you can check them out for yourself if you should so desire. Also, given the nature of this particular topic, I will endeavor to continue to keep my ear to the ground and keep you all informed should any more news come. But in any case, this has been Ace. Hope to see you guys again soon. Take care. Ace out.